Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, your boy Samson Biggs. Ooh, look at those guns here with another video. And uh, we're going to have a special video today because uh, uh, I just invented something that is so freaking awesome, so delicious. You guys got to try it. So, what I did was I put butterscotch schnapps and vodka and about two ounces of heavy cream filled it up put in my protein powder some BCAs shook it up really good and this is one very delicious alcoholic protein shake oh it's so good it's like it's it's just so good I can this is the best protein shake I've ever had in my life it's fantastic. The butterscotch schnapps. Um, I was Googling something, and I never even thought of butterscotch schnapps. It's hard to say. It, um, to put it into my protein shake. But it, it goes so well. Like, it mixes so well. The taste is fantastic. But anyway, the question of the day is, does alcohol mess up your gains? Can alcohol impair your muscle gains science versus experience that's right so i've googled it i've looked i've read the reports and of course science is going to say one thing and experience usually is going to say something else right so with science, they're saying, yes, if you drink too much alcohol, it's going to slow your muscle gains, blah, 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 blah. But from my personal experience, being one of the biggest dudes in Arizona, okay, 290 pounds, okay, swollen, drink alcohol every night before I go to bed. In fact, after I work out, usually I work out at night. When I get home, the first thing I do is take a protein shake and then drink, have an alcoholic drink. Has it impeded my muscle gains? Absolutely not. Personal experience. Because no matter what these scientists tell you, it's not always going to be true. Now, don't get me wrong. Some things I don't argue with. Like when it comes to disease and whatever. Broken bones, whatever whatever the doctors need to do. Okay, do what you got to do. But there are certain things that I just don't, you know. Personal experience is personal experience. And so for me personally, alcohol has never impeded my ability to gain muscle. And truth be told, I've known a lot of bodybuilders, bouncers usually, a lot of bouncers who are also bodybuilders who lift, get jacked, and also drink a lot. <laughs> Most freaking athletes, right? NFL pro athletes, freaking... NBA, you name it, you name the, the, the organization, you name the sport, all these athletes, what are they doing? When they're not playing, they're drinking. <laughs> what are all the jocks doing? They drink alcohol. Does it impede their ability to play their sports? I mean, it depends. If they had a, a crazy night of drinking and then they go to practice the next day, sure, they're going to be dragging ass. But it's going to make them less of an athlete? No, come on. Let's be honest here. Let's be honest. All the best jocks, all the best athletes, <laughs> they're alcoholics. <laughs> they're party animals. That's one of the things that makes them such a good athlete is because they don't care and they freaking just balls to the wall all the time. So, now... This is not science, guys. I am not a scientist. I am not a doctor. Well, I'm a, I'm a doctor of muscle. If you count all my years of 
exercise, then yeah, I'm a doctor of muscle. But I have not been uh, given a, a, a doctorate from any, or PhD from any school or anything like that. So just, you know, accept what you want, okay? This is not advice, okay? Do what you got to do. Make your own decisions. But I will tell you, enjoy schnapps, vodka, and protein shake. And the heavy cream, too. But only the heavy cream, guys. Remember, if you're going to be doing cream, um, that's fat, right? So if you got to be careful. Watch your fat count. If you're doing a, a low-fat diet, for me personally right now, I'm on a high-fat diet. So I'm doing low carbs so I can drink all the heavy cream I want. <laughs> it's your boy, Samson Biggs. We'll be back with more videos, man. I'm going to tell you how I think. I'm going to tell you what I like to do. And I'm going to tell you my personal experience. And sometimes my personal experience is going to go against science. But it is what it is, right? It is what it is. If you want to be 290... If you want to be jacked, if you want to walk around and people go, holy crap, look at that dude. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. <laughs> Make sure you check out my Twitter if you are above 18. If you're not above 18, you cannot look at my Twitter. Also, uh, what else? Oh, yeah, we'll be back with more cryptocurrency stuff coming up. We're making a lot of money in crypto, you guys. You got to make sure you're getting in on the money, too. And, uh, yeah, we'll be back with more videos shortly.